Hey everyone, Mela Ash, IFBB Pro and six time Olympian with the fabulous physique artist, Rachel Daniels. We're here at Precision, Precision Fitness. Fitness. <laughs> Should we do that again? <laughs> okay. We're here at Precision Fitness. <laughs> now I can't even do this. Okay. All right, ready? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try. We're gonna, we're gonna try this one, okay. more, one more again. All right. One more again. Third time's a charm. All right. Thirtieth time is better. Okay. okay. People generally like boxes and they like categories. The world feels more comfortable and they can put people in them. Um, but there's some people who just don't fit into boxes and categories. I think it's my job as an artist to evolve and go to war with my art and constantly question it and find new genres and sometimes you have to create them. And I think there's other people out there who are at their in their own wars with their own art and I like to find them and I like to go to battle with them and I like to collaborate with them. I'm IFBB Olympian Rachel Daniels and this is a day in my life. This is my life. Okay. <laughs> hey everyone, Mela Ash, IFBB Pro and six time Olympian with the fabulous physique artist, Rachel Daniels. We are here at Precision Fitness in Dallas, Texas to bring you guys an awesome posing seminar. We both love posing, we're both posing coaches and we wanna bring you guys out today and give you a little bit of what we have to offer. We're gonna do some transitions, mandatory, talk about show day, presentation, technique. Shoulders need to be balanced. It's great getting people in here. It's getting them out of their comfort zones. Like she said, you want to lock the ductors. That's gonna help you leg straight, lock the ductor, stand tall. Because a lot of people really are eager to learn. It's just getting those, those nerves down so that you can get them to a place where they can really start showing confidence, exploring their body and finding their strengths. It's, it's one of the things that I love so much because it's the, it's the moment that you get to truly show you, your personality. You know, in each of the divisions, you have mandatory. You know, you have to move the way you're required to move. They're nice, these aren't flared out, and then she's just tilting a little bit back here. You're allowing your body to flow the way that your personality wants to flow. Just makes the posing, it takes it to another level. In the back leg, remember. See when I push the floor, see all these lines? Those are gonna light the fuck up if you're late. Face the rear for back double bicep. Same thing as the front double bicep. Get the primary leg first. Turn the feet out and spike the secondary leg. Spike the foot. Here I love Turn the knees adapting out. to other people's cues and getting them in the poses that are best for them on stage Correct. so we can send them out there with, the with some confidence. It's not just teaching somebody to pose how you pose. It becomes living art. And there's nothing more beautiful to me than living art. So. Like she was saying, some people are sensual and some people are sexy, and if you're trying to fit somebody into your style, that doesn't necessarily work, even if that style looks great on you. Hit it, do your hips. So another thing is, your hips need to be centered here, okay? So a really good teacher has the ability to not teach someone else their style, but help that person find their own style, whatever it is, and bring that out. I'm like, when you see somebody that's moving on stage and there's a, there's a passion to them, and that is so beautiful that it captivates the audience, muscle doesn't make you manly. Muscle is sexy. Muscle is beautiful. Show them how beautiful you are. It, you can't, you can't bottle that. I'm like, you can't, it, 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 there's no words to describe it. And the thing is that there's so many people that don't understand how important posing is for this sport. You know, they spend all these months getting their body ready and getting conditioned and they get on stage and they can't showcase all that hard work. Yeah, but if you here. take the time to truly Good. understand your body and to how to pose it the right way, you will light up the stage. Don't go past the biceps. When your hands go past your biceps, you're covering your biceps. So everyone's out there giving their best. We're actually really working them. We were working them for a really long time today, but that's what I, I really believe in. I don't think that posing seminars should be about the athletes talking about all the great things that they've done. The people here already know who you are and they're here because they want to learn. So I think that, and Mela agrees, the majority of this time should be spent letting the athletes practice their posing. So I'm really glad that we got to do that here today. And I love what I do and I hope to do many more like this. It's, it's priceless. Can't beat it. Let's go past the biceps. Such a really good. Yep. 
Feels a good day.